amazing piece of history. This walking stick is a relic from the Titanic. And now it's at the center of a family dispute. The cane was owned by a wealthy first-class passenger on board the doomed ship, which sank 107 years ago after it hit an iceberg. The cane has a unique feature. This lights up. That battery-powered tip proved invaluable when an heiress named Ella White found herself on lifeboat number eight after the ship went down. Bring in your oars over there. Heroically, she took this cane, this stick, lit it up, and spent the night waving it back and forth in a hope in the in an effort to attract a rescue ship. In his famous book, A Night to Remember, author Walter Lord wrote this about Mrs. White. She had pointed herself a sort of signal man. She had a cane with a built-in electric light and during most of the night she waved it fiercely about. Now the cane is being put up for auction by a descendant of White's. It's believed it could fetch as much as half a million dollars. But another descendant, Samuel Hoving, is disputing ownership. He says the cane was in his father's possession for years until it mysteriously vanished. I grew up with this item in the umbrella stand of uh, the foyer where we grew up here in Manhattan. My father was very proud of it. It became missing from my father's apartment in the, in the 70s. Are you not protesting this auction? I am wholly protesting the auction and will contest it and try to halt this sale. Looks like the dispute over this historic artifact from the Titanic is turning into a fight to remember.